Hey Magic Community, T1 Glistener Elf here. Uh, this is a deck that I threw together for a quest that's going on right now. The quest is I have to do 20, I cast 20 white or black spells. So I wanted to show off a little bit. This is, I'm calling it Golgari Glass. It's based on the card Glass of the Guild Pact. Multicolored creatures you control get plus one, plus one. All of the creatures in the deck are multicolored creatures. So this is just two mana, lords, all of the creatures here. Now, I only have it as a one of because I only have one. I have three rare wild cards, but I'm saving those for, for lands uh, coming up. Uh, but, but, when glass rotates and it's just a historic card, I will be making, I already have plans for showing this card off, just a, just a lot more. So, uh, and stay tuned for that. But for right now, the, the buffs in the deck include that and Heraldic Banner. So, uh, creatures of the chosen color, I'm gonna be saying black because it helps me cast one extra spell. But it doesn't really matter all that much. It could be black or green. I uh, get plus one, plus oh, and then it just makes mana for me as well. So one extra mana, and it doesn't lord, doesn't buff them quite as well, doesn't buff the toughness, but it makes mana too. Uh, other than that, we have some interaction, lots of interaction. We have like status statue, uh, we have assassin's trophy, find finality. By the way, in case it weren't obvious from the only having one glass in the deck, this is definitely not optimal. Uh, whenever you see a deck of mine that has a bunch of 1, 2, and 3 ups, probably not optimal. But this is what I had. You could very easily make some changes to it to make it better, for sure. Um, like, status statue probably doesn't make the final cut. <laughs> uh, but then we have our creatures. We have Glow Spore Shaman as a 3 1, uh, Skull Prophet as a 3 1. So both of them 2 mana 3 1. Uh, either makes mana or mills you, or kind of, it finds your lands, kind of. You mill three, and then put a land from your graveyard back on top of your library, if you feel like it. Uh, Swarm Guildmage just as a one of, because late in the game it can give menace. The life gain's probably not going to matter all that much, I'm just going to go out on a limb. But there's still a lot of mono red, so maybe, but mostly it's for the late game menace and buff. So Glass, we have a little more interaction. We have Opnik Sills' Cruelty. Minus five, minus five, and Exile can help to deal with some of the indestructible, some of the gods that are running around, so that matters, potentially. Uh, three mana, two, three, makes mana, and death touch, and lifelink, so this is a this is a pretty decent card. Ocran Assassin is excellent. You may have seen this in a deck where uh, it attacks, all creatures able to block it do so, and then you either pump up the Assassin so that it can take out a bunch of other creatures, or you pump up something that couldn't be blocked otherwise. Uh, similar to the way that you might do so in like an infect or stompy strategy. Uh, that's one way you could build it. What I'm doing is I'm trying to make as many pump effects go onto it from glass and banner so that it can just take out a bunch of creatures as it goes, becoming say a two or three for one. And of course it lets the others swing through. Uh, Death Sprout, just as a four mana, this is another reason why you, ch you say black with banner, uh, deals with a creature and we get a basic out of our deck. Uh, Gugari Fine Broker, so it is a three for it that Regr it's kind of like a regrowth, but it only returns a permanent card from your graveyard to your hand. So, not quite the same, not quite regrowth. Uh, Vraska, I have three, including the one from way back in the day, from being in the beta. Uh, one Underrealm Lich as a sort of a curve topper. Um, sort of, <laughs> you just saw. Uh, this just makes it where instead of drawing, we look at the top three cards, put one in our hand and the rest in our grave. Uh, gives us a little bit of selection. We're Golgari, so we have cards that can take advantage of that. Theoretically, I'm not running like Mulder Hulk, for instance, though. Uh, and then we have Liliana Dreadhorde General. So, you can see, creatures in my deck are, are sort of want to die, and so whenever that happens, I get to draw a card. Plus she makes zombies, plus she makes us sack creatures. Uh, seems alright. And then one Casualties of War, just as a catch-all, blow up everything, if I need to, card. Uh, other than that, we have 24 lands, 7 swamp, 6 forest, 4 Golgari Guildgate, because I need to get some more of these. <laughs> uh, 2 Overgrown Tomb, 1 Temple of Malady, and then 4 Fabled Passage to go and get our other basics. So, you can definitely see some very easy upgrades to make to the list. Uh, but this is what I have, and so this is what we're going to try out. Uh, so let's save that, and give it a go. Uh, we're going to play Switch over here, play Glass, and give it a shot. Uh, this is even if my internet would let me play ranked and not have to worry about drops, which is not the case, unfortunately. It is it is going to give me issues. But even if that were the case, this is not optimal. I'm not, I'm not playing ranked with, with this.
<laughs> Come on. All right, so I'm gonna go first. Uh, this looks fine. Yeah, this is fine. This is a key. Give my opponent the hello. You. Uh, so, way, way more coffee. <laughs> Alright, say hello, pass it right along. I think showing green is probably more likely to give our opponent a false sense of what we're playing. So I think it makes sense to start off with the forest. Oh, come on. There we go. Having a snack. Unfortunately, because I am a living vegetable, <laughs> um, I decided to pick the loudest snack that we had. Alright, so ice is brr. Ice is brr. There we go. Okay, so a 1-1 one, one flyer. Alright, fair enough, I suppose. Um, yeah, we'll just play this out. And then pass. Mine is bigger than yours. Alright, so they're, they're having to read this, <laughs> see what all this thing does. It's silly, it's dumb. Okay, there we go. So this is a flyer's deck in all likelihood. Oh, that is pretty loud. I can actually see. Okay, what is this? Hmm. I think I need to get rid of this sooner than later, so we're going to play this first. Hmm. Okay. Cost two more to cast. Uh oh. Well, okay, in that case, we can't use Death Sprout. Oh boy. So I guess we're going to start off with the banner, right? Yeah, let's do that. We'll say, uh, black. Alright. Then Haya. See if they block. They won't. Okay, fair enough. I didn't think they would, but, you know, in turn, okay. And we're not going to open, we're not going to crack this fetch land here, because we're going to try to find another land so we can kill this thing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alright, well that's not good. Now they don't have blue mana open, so they don't have their little flash flyer. So, yeah, let's go on to my turn. This is fine. Not a land. Okay. Well, that's fair enough, I guess. Alright. Not gonna block. Oh, yeah, they didn't block. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh-oh. They're still waiting. Alright, there we go. All right. Hmm. Now they can start making cat birds. Or they could just cast another one. That's not great. All right. Yeah, we're in we're in a bit of trouble. We're in a pickle. So now, I guess we have to play the Liliana. No, nope, we're dead even if we find Liliana. Yeah, we're because then they can just sack the two weakest... Cre well, I don't know, maybe. Because these can each make a, a bird, so that'll be three and three. Okay. Doesn't matter, we didn't get there. Yeah, we, we can't. Even with the two life, we can't. Hmm... I wonder, if I had used the two life instead, I guess that would buy me a little bit of time, but that's okay. We'll give him the good game. Alright. That'll do it. That'll do it. We tried. That was, a uh, that was weird. That was really weird. That's not normally how that goes. But yeah, we do have expensive removal, so instead of something like Assassin's Trophy, we have Reverse Assassin's Trophy. We, like, we get the land instead. So that, that wasn't great, but we can keep going at it. That didn't feel too... didn't feel too bad. We did also find our worst two drop. Hi. 
Hi, Jez. Let's see what you got. Ooh. Hmm. That's risky, but I'll keep it. Hello? Pass. Uh oh. Nailed it. Alright, so I didn't crack it there because I didn't think I was going to find another land. It made it more likely for me to find a land. Ever so slightly. Alright, no pump? Okay. No pump. Creature. Ooh, Snoop. Hi, Snoop. Oh, it's goblins. Fair enough. Alright, let's do this a couple times. Get a forest. And then get a swamp. There we go. Uh-oh. Okay. No, that's fine. That's fine. Um, so we can go Skull into Guildgate. Get this thing. We're absolutely going to trade. They attack. 100%. Uh-oh. Put it on Snoop. Oh, just you, okay. Uh, hello? There we go. Oh, they didn't use the mana. I should've, uh, it's fine. It's fine, I messed up. It's fine. I messed up. Okay. So we'll do Fine Broker first. Uh, I think we're good on lands, right? Yeah. Let's get profit back. Just to make sure we keep having creatures. That way we can go banner, profit next turn. Pretty easily. Uh oh. Ooh, okay. Man. Okay, yeah, that's a lot. That's a lot going on. I think I need to kill this thing. What do you think? Um, Vraska destroy Snoop? Rip Snoop Dog? And then we can just get her right back with another fine broker. Yeah, Vraska's dead no matter what. Dodger can hit her anyway. Let that go in tapped, and then pass the turn. Sorry, Vraska. I'm sorry, little one. I've gotten Evangeline to, to say that more now. It's the, the line from... Oh, God. This is fun. Uh, from... What was it? Uh, Avengers Infinity War? Oh, I'm sorry, little one. Alright, who's attacking whom? Alright, that makes more sense. Minter. Going on to... That one. Alright, fair enough. So I don't think I can block you, right? Can I? Ugh. It's tricky. Ow. Ow. Alright, double banner. Not the time, but that would be neat. That would be neat. Um. So we can go... Black? Oh, that probably wasn't right, was it? It's okay, I didn't have the mana to go Fine Broker and Profit. I could have done Double Profit, though. Fair enough. And their pet, there it goes. There's the ability. I think that this is right. I'm, 
at five. Uh oh. Oh god. That's a good game for me. They got me. Yeah, that's what happens when you leave Snoop alive. <laughs> it's a goblin themed bullet citadel. Ooh. You, you gotta take it out soon. Alright, we, we can do better. And yes, I know I could have cast more green and black spells, but if I'm gonna get to those four wins, I'm gonna hit those 14 cards in the process of doing so. 14 cards left. Lim Duel, okay. Without the little accent over the U. Lim Duel's Vault. I, I will keep this, this is fine. Alright, and then, hello, pass. Hello. Right. Into Shaman, into Assassin, into Raska. I'll just do that right now. It looks okay. This looks reasonable. Alright. So then play that out. Get a 3 1. 1, 2, 3. Uh. Sure, let's thin the deck a bit more. Plus, we're gonna get to the fourth card pretty soon anyway, so it, it'll just come in untapped. Gee, I wonder what that card was. Hmm. Hiya. Well, they have something. They're not doing it, but they have something. Maybe. That come in. Assassin. Assassin. Alright. It's pretty neat. It's pretty cool. What you got? What do you have? A dog. A dogo. A wolf. Well, bark, bark to you too. Uh oh. Uh oh. We could just attack and let the assassin take it out. Instead of Raska doing that. I think that that's the correct play. So all creatures able to block her have to do so. So, there's a trade. And then... Alright. Get a forest. Alright. We're just gonna plus to plus. I don't dwell on what's about to happen. For now, we're just going to plus. Ooh, okay. Uh oh. Fair enough, I guess. Let's see if I hit a land drop here. How I'd like to play out the next couple turns. Oh! Oh boy. Well, we can use her to blow that up, at least. I do have a Death Sprout, so I'm tempted to wait. We'll start off by attacking. Alright, that's fair. Okay, and then past turn. It should be really, really obvious I have something going on. I have something up my sleeve. It should be abundantly obvious that there's some trickery going on here. Alright, there's Champion. Okay. That's alright. Alright, do it. Oh, it's Vigilant now! Ooh, yeah, that's a problem.
So, the Vigilance is permanent. The Life Gain, the Life Link, not so much. Okay. Pass that right along. Not just a flesh wound. I admit, that, that kind of caught me off guard. I shouldn't have been too surprised. Sentinel's Eyes is going to be in the list regardless. And this seems a little unnecessary with Liliana in hand, but I need a land in order to even play her. So we're going to get yet another Swamp. Alright, well, and then we had it anyway, so it's fine. Um... Is there even a point to attacking here? Guess I'll do this. I do hope you make this battle exciting for me. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, there is. Sacrifice you. Don't dwell on what's about Yep, there we go. Got there. All right. And hello. They were lousy yes. Anyway. Now we do this. I I is big smart. I is big smart, folks. Uh, that doesn't work the way you think oh, it works. I do love a good death. It doesn't man. quite work the way they. Oops. Yeah, it is sacrifice. All right, that's fair. They can still reload from here. It has flying. That's a problem. Oh, okay. Okay. So they're not tapped out. They can actually do something there. Alright. Hmm. So, let's see. How do I go about this? I can blow up land enchantment creature land enchantment creature I won't be able to deal with the druid though alright creature enchantment land <laughs> no 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 okay alright target enchantment this one target a land uh this one there we go. Boom, boom, boom. Gotta get that. That's... I, I remember, because of the lyrics, I remember that song was apparently 2008. Alright. Fair enough, I guess. Make a Zamboni. <laughs> Expendable, except me. All right, there we go. We got there. We did stuff. Make them do it. Make them do it. Block. I mean, Sentinel's Mark? Carmage's Blessing. Okay. Boom. Alright, so I'll draw again. Hey! Got there. Not so much off the creatures, they just stole for time. <laughs> Planeswalker City. Uh, two Liliana, three Braska. Okay. Let's try that again. We can do that. Golgari Glass, get me there. This super duper budgety deck. <laughs> Serious Paul. Hi, Paul. Alright. That's not a lot of land for what we're trying to do. I think we'll get there, though. This sadly isn't one of the ones that ramps. Alright. Pass. Okay. Aha! Uh -huh. Aha! Uh -huh. Yeah, we might be in trouble, but we have cruelty, so if they go a Johnny next, we'll be fine. 
Alright, let's see. Did we get there? We did. But, we're gonna have to give up the... Yeah, let's do Temple next. That's fine. Okay. That's fine. Hmm. Okay. No pride, mate. So I guess it ended up working out for both of us. Okay. In that case, I guess we'll play Assassin. And then pass it right along. I say that as if I have any choice. I definitely do not. Play a pride, mate. I dare you. Oh! It's indestructible. I can't just kill it here. I don't know if that's necessarily right. We're gonna try it. Boom. Okay. And then pass. Yeah, that, that may come back and bite me. Oh, okay. That's fair. They're on the Healer Hawk Beatdown plan. I, I dig it, personally. Alright, so if this thing dies, then fine, we'll get fine two cre uh, creatures. Alright. Just like that. Alright. Here goes. You know what? Second verse, same as the first. Oh, hi, Soren. I did not stop this. Oh, boy. Fight, but I will finish it. Hmm. Out of range of Braska. I am whole. It's okay. Blood. Okay. So, since that got to stick around. Lich can too. How many creatures do they have in their grave? None. I don't want to give them any, if I can help it. So play the Lich. And... Hold on. Oh, okay, 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 cool. Sorry for the noise. Oh, yay. Oh goody. Blood is my beginning. It will be your end. My bloodline flows through you. Wait, that did nothing. Death touch and lifelink. It already has lifelink. Hmm. <laughs> Time for a drink. That should be a bit of a tell for them. Vraska can take this one out. But then this Soren kills her. This one's a sorcery. I uh, probably should have waited, because only I only need one more land. Hello? I, I, I clicked it. I only need one more land to play Finality. Oh no, tell me my internet's not out. What is going on? What is going on? I'm gonna check to make sure. It says I'm okay. Uh-oh. It's gonna look like I rage quit or something. 
Well, I don't know. I'm in a decent spot, so maybe it doesn't look like a rager. Ah. Uh... This is why I don't play ranked anymore. I'm I'm sorry, folks. I'm sorry. This is why I don't play ranked. Nothing against it. I just I can't have this happen. So yeah. <laughs> I guess I don't have a problem playing with bronze. Bronze. Oh, we're back. We're back. Okay. Back. back. Maybe. Okay. Come on. She's up to two. Hello? There we go. Okay. I have zero timeouts left. Ah! That's not good. It's no bueno. Alright. And then we will... go to combat. Try to send both of them at you. If we can. Alright, that's fine. <laughs> Weak. In turn, okay. And then end of turn, Assassin's Trophy on Big Soren. And then Vraska takes out Baby Soren. Alright, that's fine. I should have done it sooner, though, for that very reason. I should have done it sooner. Ah, uh, you genius. I was a little distracted. <laughs> oh well. Okay, now that's a problem. Alright, who's hitting? Alright. Boom. Better late than never, I guess. Itchy nose. Ooh, I could get double Vraska. That'd be interesting. Instead of Banner. Time you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. It wasn't my fight anyway. So... Hmm. I have to discard it, or pay for life. I don't have the most life right now. I'm about to get some more, but I definitely don't have the most life. So how about we just swing... Oh, hello. Nope. Not what I meant to... Oh, undo. Undo. There we go. See to combat. Cool. Attack with just you. Trade with the vampire. Probably. Probably. Oh. Yeah, that's a problem. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well. We gained a little life. It, it wasn't worth it, but we gained some life. Alright, so we're about to lose Vraska. At the very least, we're losing Vraska. Okay, that's fine. They know I have Assassin, though, so they can't wait too long. I guess they're, they might not be worried about Assassin, because it only has one power, but it gets better. It gets way... Oh my goodness. How many lands do we have? Not nearly enough. So, I'm going to take the land... I am somewhat tempted to use Death Sprout. Does come in tapped, just to ramp me. Alternatively, I could use Vraska. No, I think I need the I need the ramp. All right. Have to pass so that they just attack with the Hawks. Beginning of your instep, if an opponent lost life this turn, put a counter on it. Cool. Alright, 
Alright, let's see who's attacking. Who's coming in? Field. Get a swamp. It's almost always going to be a swamp, apparently. Alright, can't block. One of the issues with doing it there, though, is that this thing flies and so wouldn't be subject to assassin. Alright, what I find? Fine broker. Yes. Okay. So what's in the graveyard? You can just play glass back. That'd be kind of interesting. It doesn't actually get us there, though. Liliana. Ooh. Ooh, let's get Liliana. Actually, even Liliana's not necessarily going to be good enough, is she? It's, it's still probably right, but... It's easier for them to sack creatures than it is for me to. See, if I have to sack two creatures, it might be in a, in a pickle. They, they easily... Well, no. No, it's fine, actually. That's fine. If you browse her. Alright, get Liliana back. It's not something you necessarily want to do, but you can. We already have a blocker for the ground anyway. And these all fly. Alright. It's not great. We're not in a great spot, but we can still do this. We can manage this. Alright. On to my turn. Ooh. We're gonna need this. Death Sprout. Yeah, we are 30 cards. Yeah, we, we are fine. We're fine. Alternatively, I can use the Death Sprout here instead. And I can hold up the ability to... Yeah. Yeah, that's probably be, probably better. We're just going to do this now so they don't have a chance to protect it. Hopefully. Okay. Alright. Let's see. In turn. I know we can do this. I know that we can do this. Unlikely though it may seem. Alright. Just gonna do this now. Gain two, lose two. So we've stabilized. They're still ticking up, but... Oh, there's another one. Ooh. Kind of would like to have both, but that seems a little unnecessary. But I already have so many lands. No, it's fine, it's fine. It'll let me play out my hand a little bit more quickly. Yeah, when you're giving that up, it probably should say something. Maybe, just maybe. So we can go one, two, three, four, play Vraska. Leave before I make you disappear. Play out a Prowler. Now, how do I, how would I like to go about doing this? Um, I can destroy something, but then she dies to the other. So we're gonna go plus. Ooh, 
I think I, I think it was a little silly there, but that's okay. Sacrifice you. Choose one. Oh, if you would draw a card. That's right. If you would draw a card. Fair enough. Fair enough. I'm actually about to just fly through my deck if I'm not careful. Because of that lich. Alright. Not, not a lot of you. Alright. Oh, 23 cards. I do need to be careful. Lilion is actually going to make me draw a bunch of cards if I don't drop the Lich. Ooh. Okay. Fair enough. That, that is definitely fair enough. Okay. We're still fine for now. Kind of. do I have left? So let's fire the Death Sprout off first. Not a lot of choices left. Aha! Okay. Uh, that seemed a little premature, to be honest. But when I used the Liliana there, I was about to have to sack the Lich, just so I wouldn't deck myself out. <laughs> That's a weird spot to be in, but, you know, you do what you have to do, I guess. Uh, we'll play it out a little bit more. Only, I only need two more wins. So... Seven more game. No. <laughs> I'm okay. It's alright. Uh, headphone users rip. Hmm. OPQ looks like a monocle eye. Sorry, so next turn profit, next turn banner. Alright. And hopefully well we'll see, this thing this thing's gonna die, isn't it? Yeah. I mean that's fair. That's alright. So in that case, I guess we'll go Crowler next. Uro, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. All right. Well, I'm not on land destruction now, so that is a real concern. Hmm. So I do banners so that I can get Prowler and Profit next turn guaranteed. If I play Prowler, it might die again. Ooh, that was weird. No, 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 no. That was that was wrong. I should have picked green. All right. Well, they're they're one play. Oh. Okay. Like the phases of the moon, like wax. All right. What's your name? You will find my notes helpful. Let's see. So many good cards in this. I mean, they're in great... Oh. oh, well, that's something to look forward to. Why be good when you can be lucky, I suppose? Or at least that's how it's working out here. You're four mana, right? Yep, you're four. Okay. All right, so we'll surprise them with the glass next turn. All right. Hmm. Okay, so they... They could just play Uro if they use this to minus to get an island. No way. Do they have a forest? They did. They have. Oh, but it comes in tapped. Oh, but Fable Passage. So minus to get Fable Passage, so they can have green, green, blue, blue, and then. Well, I mean. Yeah. 
or an island. Green, green, blue, blue. Whatever. However they want to do it. Or not. They're gonna they're doing something else. Extinction event. That's that's so weird, because see I have three mana and two mana. That seems like a weird choice. Well, okay. Uh, but they did find it. So... Glass? Kinda wanna take Tamiyo out now, to be honest. Yeah, I don't want to play out another creature with an Extinction and Event in their hand. Go ahead. Beg for mercy. Oh, this is what I get for not blessing her first. It's okay, it wouldn't matter. Her plus doesn't do, any, doesn't do anything on its own. Okay, Shark Typhoon, uh-oh, a 2-2, two -two. okay, that's fair. Wait, did they, they surely meant to block, right? I question right? This outcome. Maybe not. So I can minus to kill this thing. Sorry. All right, in that case, yeah. Uh, or I could plus just so that she goes back to the same point. We'll just, we'll kill it. It's gonna be a blocker for our creatures anyway. Oh, wait a minute, no! They had extinction events, so if they named, in the unlikely event, they named even. That's fine. They're, I can't play to my opponent making mistakes, even though this is arena unranked. Hmm. They don't have any artifacts, right? Yeah, that's just me. Destroy land and destroy a creature. We can do that. Target a creature. Target a land. And say triumph. Get a swamp. Sure. I mean, that's fair, I suppose. Okay. Extinction event now? You're gonna have to do it at some point. Ooh, okay. Ooh, that seems uh, fine. That seems all right. All right. There we go. So now extinction event still doesn't hit all the all the creatures on my side. I mean, that's fair. Casual. Ooh, okay. Want to be a little careful about using this glow spore shaman here. It's just gonna die. Um, I think I should wait. Just gonna get exiled. Okay, so this is going to be two. So now I can play the Shaman, and then if they'd like to, they can get rid of their creature, sure. But probably not. I mean, to be fair, without the glass, mine is now too weak. Oh. Oh, boy. Let's play them all out. Alright. 
Do we need to land on top? I'm gonna say no. Alright. We're getting there. We're getting there, opponent. Then again, they can cast Uro again. Which they probably should. At this point, they probably should. Ooh! Okay. Never mind. Never mind. We do have a little bit of time, but good god. Oh, hold up control. Just so that they don't know. Guess I should do full control, shouldn't I? I mean, hold full control, whatever it's called. There's Hero. Okay. I have become too involved with my work. This is slowly starting to spiral out of control. This is quickly starting to spiral out of control. Alright. Yes, we'll let that resolve. Hmm, so if I lose this profit, I lose green mana, so I hope that they realize that. But, they would have to lose their crisis too. But they can cast Extinction Event here. Okay, yeah, there it goes. Especially given how many cards they have in hand, that should be an acceptable trade for them. Yep, there it goes. Fair. Fair enough. Ooh. I mean, we're not dead yet, but... Pass. But... They're about to go to 17, we're about to go to 22. And look at how many... Co I know you win 0% of the games you concede, but... Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna call that one there. I'm gonna call that one right there. Man, we resolved the casualties and we still lost. This is this is a fun game, folks. This is a fun game. I I'm a fan. A little bit. My back. My back. I'm gonna have an opportunity. I didn't actually notice the bracelet that Sarah is wearing. Hmm. So real talk, if I ever do switch off of Karn, so I'm probably never gonna actually change to like a, another avatar, certainly not one that you have to pay money or coins for because it's purely cosmetic and I don't care. <laughs> Um, but, if I, if I were to, Sarah would be high on up there. For the same reason that I, I dig Celestia as my favorite guild. She seems to fit the bill pretty well. Okay. I'm gonna go to combat first. And they know I have a land, obviously. Play Prowler. Alright, let's see if we can get to that Liliana. If we can keep this thing alive. Ooh. Nice. Uh-oh. What's this? Oh, please. Hmm, okay. That's interesting. I don't know what to think about that. I do know I am going to have to blow this thing up. And yes, I should have used Fable Passage there, so that... Oh, that's fine. Yeah. It's fine. So that I thin the deck a little bit. Now that we definitely have enough lands. Ah, uh, but it's okay. It's okay. Dread Presence. Ooh. Land... And, sorry, Shaman. Rip, Shaman. 
shaman become- oh no, you're gonna draw a card instead. That's fair. I like that. Okay. Okay. Whale. Kinda just wanna do it again, to be honest. Um. Or I could play Liliana. I do want to take out the Dread Presence first, actually. I think that that's probably the better play. Forest. Get a Swamp again. Just have all of the Swamps. They're, they're pretty important for what we're trying to do. Pretty important. Play this. We do not need any more lands. I'm gonna say no. We are fine on lands. Alright, let's gain a little bit of life against the life gain deck. Totally matters. Alright. Scry one. What you got? Impulse? Okay. Ah, presence. I turned my head, but did they play land yet? No, okay. Oh, there's a land. There's a swamp, actually. So, that comes in. Kill Shaman, please. Okay. Well, that makes sense, at least. Um, so now... I guess attack first, right? So whichever way they block, they lose a creature. This one has Death Touch, this one's just three power. So we'll, we'll attack with both. Alright. Hi, Liliana. This isn't your average zombie horde. No, it's not. This looks like a fun new toy. Uh you we'll hold that in our hand. Alright. So when this goes away, if you do game for exile, if you do game for life. All right, another tome. Okay. Obvious block is obvious. I'm gonna make him do it. That means they didn't find a swamp. They were a lousy servant ah. anyway. Okay. So draw a card. Game four. I like that this is a color mirror. Alright, what you got? Anything else? Aha, okay. And then they gain 8 life. Ooh, okay. Alright. Let's get a forest instead. Get a frest. We're gonna name black, because the tokens actually are just black. I might as well do this now, it doesn't really matter. Then just hit him for a bunch. And now it actually will kill the Dread Presence if they don't find a swamp. They didn't scry on upkeep. Oh boy. Oh boy. Ah, there we go. Uh, two to Liliana, two to the token. Go. Oh, no, four to Liliana. Okay. That's interesting. That is really interesting, then. Okay. Well. Let's keep at it. That was probably wrong. Maybe I should... I don't want to get rid of the Lily, though. Uh-oh. Yeah, no, let's decline. I think we're good. Pretty sure we're good. Alright. And then we will end the turn. Hold up our control again. Although I didn't hold control last turn, so I... Oh, I think they know. Now it's okay. They're only at 8. They're only at 8 life, so it could be worse. They're at virtual 12, though, because they'll find a swamp. I, I strongly suspect they'll find a swamp. God, 
I do love this deck though. And that explains the, hey look, I'm gonna gain eight life card. It doesn't make a lot of sense otherwise. Okay. Interesting. Going for the un or going for the tapped one. I don't agree with that. So we're gonna draw a card. Draw a cat. There we go. So why? Oh boy. Oh boy, now it's getting silly. Now it's getting out of hand. Uh-oh. Starting to come together. It's starting to make sense. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alright, well we get to draw a card. Not that it matters if we can't make it to our next turn. I'm waiting for Gary. Well, there's enough green in the deck. Maybe Gary's not in here, but I, I assume somewhere Grey Merchant of Asphodel would show up. Oh boy. Nope, it's just the killing me on the I have Dread Presence times two plan, I guess. Alright. In the... Well, actually, I can't use Lily minus now, because she's at... She's below four. Uh-oh. This is such a weird order. Why aren't you killing Liliana first so that I don't keep drawing cards? This is a really strange order for doing this. Waste not, want not. Okay. So if they had a land on top, that lets them try to draw through it to keep going. They were a lousy servant anyway. Alright. Now she's done. Finally. And then one... Alright. Three of me. Uh, that was strange. That was really, really strange. But now look at our life totals. So they're going to draw a card, I would assume. No, they're just going to deal more damage. Okay. I guess they still have stuff. They're still going. They're still going. That explains this scry, by the way. That is a weird card, but with Bola Citadel it makes sense. I'm gonna give them the nice. This is this is cool, watching this all happen. Okay, um, so we lose, but if we lose, we're gonna we're gonna have fun doing it. If we lose, that's not an if anymore. All right, we'll name Black again. All right, there we go. There we go. So any creatures that do attack have to deal with death touch. Any creatures that don't attack, oh boy, cultivate. That's right. That's in standard again. I, I can't even be mad at it. I don't. Having circuitous root and cultivate and beanstalk giant feels a little odd. <laughs> a little bit. Okay. Yeah, there was no way that they weren't going to have those. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, they can play more. Keep going. I want to see this combo off. actually not sure that Azusa, the second Azusa, would give you any more land drops because of the way that it's worded. You would still only get two additional lands altogether. Aha! Good game. Yep, I just dead that turn. That was cool. I don't care that I lost. That was cool to watch. Bola Citadel is legitimately one of the most hype cards I, I get to play. I'm gonna miss it being in standard, even though I've hardly gotten to play with it, to be honest. I also play with it in Vintage too, where you use Tinker to get it on turn one, <laughs> and then you just tell your opponent, good game. That's generally how, oh, okay, how that works. Yeah, this is fine. We can make this work. I'm gonna play the Guild Gate first so that Fable Passage doesn't thin me. 
Give him the hello as soon as it lets me. I can, I can get to four wins, I promise. At some point. All right. Hello. All right. Come on. Cycle deck. Cool. Cool. We can blow that up with Vraska, so I'm not too terribly worried. Uh, glow Spore first. Probably not going to need an extra land. I'm going to say no. Even though we have Liliana, maybe that was wrong, but we have a ramp card and two more lands. We're probably going to find the sixth mana source. Prob just going to go out on a limb and say probably. Uh, Coatl, okay. Oh, well then we find an extra Liliana. So, sure. Uh, huh. Hmm. On the off chance that they think it's a good idea. Black? Alright. What do they feel like doing? Just letting it through. Okay. So this actually does get plus and plus one counters. So it's what the Death Sprout will be going towards. For sure. This thing gets out of control very quickly. And no, we couldn't leave this back as a blocker because they can cycle so many cards they can actually get it over the four power here. Beginning of your upkeep, draw a card if you control a creature with the greatest power. Okay. I have bad news for you, opponent. I have dreadful news for you. I'm gonna do this first. So we are indeed going to have enough. We get a forest. Blow this up now. Get a swamp. And then hi Alright. Otherwise, what happens? Let's see. Otherwise, you put a plus one plus one counter on a creature you control that they don't have. That's right. Okay, cool. That's right. I considered this for uh, Azuri EDH. Oh no, not again. Well, um. They're close enough to death, and they only have three counters on the seas. I can wait on using Vraska there. Instead, it might be better. Maybe. I'm gonna minus. Alright, blow that up. I won't forgive this. Sure you won't. Alright. And then hi yah. Yeah, they're pretty close to done as it is. Also, they may be getting mana screwed here, so I can't, certainly can't get on him too much. Yeah, the color screw up might be real. Hello? Uh, give me a moment, folks, I'm sorry.
All right, so my apologies for that. Um, also, I have default ringtone in current year, so that needs to get changed too. I, there's plenty of options. All right, but I'm sorry, that was a really important call, so I, I did have to take that. My, my apologies. We'll get one more in, get one more game in, and then we should be good. Here's to hoping. Crossing fingers, hidden dragon. All right, if I had thought about it, before I got back on, I would have had some more so we don't crunch everybody's ears. I don't know, I hope that's not too loud. <laughs> my apologies. It's good for me. I need to obviously keep my figure. <laughs> okay. Versus Pizzato. Okay. I still have about half the container of coffee left. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I am I am mildly elated right now. I, I got some good news and I am super happy about it. So we're gonna play the Guildgate first because I don't want to scry yet. We we don't we want to wait until we know what we're playing against before we try to cash in our wild cards, if you will. Alright, so this one needs seven or more cards in their graveyard. Okay, cool. So we have a little bit of time. In that case, there's not... I mean, we could play a Skull Prophet. That's what we'll do instead. We'll play Skull Prophet and wait on the AstroTurf. <laughs> the uh, Assassin's Trophy. Alright. Oof. Oh. Yeah, when it blows up a Gruel Turf, it's an Astro Turf. Also, another reason why you'd want to do that. Um, we can blow up Moo. Hi, Moo. Now, this thing can't attack, but it can't block unless you have four more cards. They have four cards in hand. Of course they do. Uh, okay. Way Yol. So, um, we would actually need to blow this thing up in order to swing through. Play the Temple. Yes. Alright, see what we have? We have a Find Broker. I don't know that that's great here, but it is another creature, and... Yeah, that's fine. We'll keep that. Doesn't do anything just yet, though. Alright. We are gonna blow this thing up. It's a very technical magic term. Blow it up. Extremely technical. No. <laughs> Alright, each player mills a card. Now we can start to get somewhere. Now that is gonna go... Ah, oh, I wish I had thought of that. I, I keep forgetting that that thing le reads like a Billy Mays commercial. It always has more text on it. It's not quite as bad as questing based, obviously, but flying and tap to mill, yeah. All right, so we're going to attack for one, and now she would have, they would have to give it up in order to have the 4-4, which they might be inclined to do. I don't know. Uh, but if not, Vraska can just blow her up anyway. Everything gets blown up. You get blown up, and you get blown up, and you get blown up. You all get blown up. Alright. Please, yeah, okay, good, good. That's what we want to see. That's exactly what we would like to see. Alright. Because, that means that Vraska ended up not actually doing all that much. Alright. Or not Vraska, Moo. Moo ended up not doing all that much. I know that's not quite how you're supposed to pronounce it, but... <laughs> Alright, now, that does mean Rip Vraska, unfortunately. Uh, that is what that means. We're gonna pass. We can make it work, though, because we have a fine broker to go and get her back. So in that cycle of four mana, guild, you know, like, XXYY mana, Creatures, Fine Broker's up there. My favorite is Crackling Drag, to literally no one's surprise, no one who knows me. Oh no, it's the flying deck again. Ah, well crap. Well crap. Ah. Oh well. We can, once we get enough mana, we can start blowing stuff up again. Always about blowing up. Well, okay, that is now, actually. We have reached that point. So we can destroy this. Okay, pay it all. All right, and hopefully they won't have any more of those. Hopefully. Anyway. Now, it just works on spells, so abilities like another Vraska, it wouldn't affect. Aha! Back to hand. Okay. 
Yay for it being a mana ability they can't respond to. Woo! No. <laughs> it's fine. That's not something I'm looking forward to, though. A 3-1 in the air for 3 with flash. Oh my goodness. Well, that's not good. Oh. Oh. Uh, and this only gets permanence. Find finality. This wouldn't kill Angel. Mmm. Okay. So, what's in our graveyard again? I, yeah, yeah, I see that. Get some more mana. We're gonna start trying to work our way through it. Hmm. Hopefully. It's the game plan, anyway. Alright. So, finality will kill everything except the one thing it needs to kill. One thing it absolutely needs to kill. Oh boy. So, finality to stall, right? Might as well attack here, because Skull Prophet's not going to live through this anyway. We still have exactly enough mana to cast it. Unless they have a counterspell, which they could have. Uh-oh. They're thinking. Ooh, okay. That's weird flex, but it works. Okay, I don't think we're getting there. I have a sneaking suspicion that we're not getting there. What do we need to get us out? Uh, Death Sprout, Albigzilsa's Cruelty, Assassin's Trophy is only a one of, um, another statue, status statue, could do it. They're thinking. Actually, so we're going to take five here. End of turn, they're going to flash in the borrower. Now, that that's not as bad. We can live through a borrower because we have Vraska. If we can kill the angel this coming turn. So we need to find some. We need to top deck. Of, we need a top deck of glory. Uh, this deck does not run Plaguebringer because it's not both colors. But that would be pretty nice right about now, to be honest. That would be okay. I could live with that. Alright. Now, maybe maybe it's your turn to have connection issues. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Uh, or they could be deep in the tank, right? Maybe? I mean, the, the first part seems pretty clear what you, what you do. You swing with your 5-5 five five angel. <laughs> that, with lifelink. That seems pretty clear. What you do from there... I don't know. Because this is unranked, it's super casual, I I kind of want to concede to make sure that they get it, um, but this would be our fourth win, so that would be all the coins. Um, oh, come on, come on opponent, still be there, please. Please? Pretty please? Who even knows what they're going through? Like, if they have something there that's occupying their attention right now. Okay. So for that, I guess instead, we will play... No? No? Land? Let's just build a, a bigger mousetrap, right? Oh, oh yeah, because they have a they have something that they can cast at instant speed. So now it's going to ask them again. Okay, okay. Actually, I, I, maybe I shouldn't play out too much because Liliana is a card. I do want to play around Liliana here. So, at this point, maybe just cast Vraska 
and plus to plus. Um, oh boy, man, I don't know. Um, yeah, maybe playing the prophet there was not correct because Liliana is one of my outs, and I already have way more than enough mana anyway. Oh, or or it just does that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, opponent. I'm sorry. Uh, bless your heart. <laughs> From the south, bless your heart. Well, I mean, technically, I guess that counts as four wins. Technically. Uh, stretching the definition of win a little bit, but... <laughs> Alright, so there is there is that. Um, I'm gonna save the packs for when Evangeline comes over. I did actually open the four uh, Throne of Eldraine ones, because I was looking to see if I could find... Uh, Heraldic Banner without having to use wild cards. Uh, granted, that still leaves gracious plenty. It leaves 22 of them for her. Uh, so she's still going to be my good luck charm. That's that's why I didn't find them. I didn't have her as my good luck charm. I, I don't actually know if the contents of these packs are already determined when you receive the pack or if it's at the time of opening. I don't know how that's done. That would be kind of interesting to find out. But, uh, you know, there you go, I suppose. All right. In, until next time. Until next time. Take care, Magic Community. I will, and by next time, I mean tomorrow. This looks like fun. This looks like a lot of fun. I'll see you then. Bye-bye. <laughs>